हेलो गाइस आई वेलकम यू ऑल ऑन दिस वंडरफुल प्लेटफॉर्म दैट इज बाइजूज एग्जाम प्रेप सो एज यू नो फ्रॉम 9 टू 11 सितंबर आर द डेट ऑफ एच ए एल एग्जाम सो गाइज टूडे आई टोक विद द स्टूडेंट्स हु अपीयर फॉर द एग्जाम टूडे सो फ्रॉम देम आई गोट सम इनपुट्स सम मेमोरी बेस्ड टॉपिक्स फ्रॉम वेयर द क्वेश्चन हैव बीन आस्ट एंड द टाइप ऑफ क्वेश्चन सो गाइज आई वुड लाइक टू टेल यू एंड एज आई मैंशन दैट इट इज मेमोरी बेस्ड ऑफ द स्टूडेंट बिकॉज वेन आई टोक टू द स्टूडेंट whatever inputs they have given me according to that i am going to tell you these topics so guys uh, for today's exam when we are talking about uh, product life cycle product life cycle was a topic from industrial engineering from which the question came that in which of the stage uh, the product is going through the major of the competition okay then my dear they are uh, they have asked about the welding defects some hot tears also questions were there and then they have asked from non traditional machining method application like they have asked the question uh, like if a component is electrically conductive then which of the following process will be suitable for that so that kind of question and nearly 3 to 4 questions were there from ntmm okay they have also asked about uh, vibration uh, that is usm process then there was a question on the reliability that is also from industrial series parallel combination so as you know this is uh, majorly from the production industrial students uh, input because in their paper uh, gate syllabus of p and i was completely followed and he also said that as that those student whom i talk with they appeared for gate p and i exam this year and, and they said that sir from p and i uh, whatever gate syllabus is uh, if you see one one mark question of gate p and i majority of the questions were directly copied from that and as hcl already mentioned that we will be following the gate uh, 2023 uh, that uh, syllabus okay so as uh, for production industrial majorly student appeared today so if you see the next was transportation in transportation you have northwest corner vogel approximation least cost method from all these comparison was there and as you know mechanical is also having many part of syllabus is in common so you will get an idea that uh, what is the level of question uh, so that when you are going to appear for the exam you can have the idea that what kind of things they are asking so machining time for shaper they are asking and they are also asking about machine design in welding joints if you remember in the welding joints whenever we study uh, that welded joints uh, subjected to pure torsion and there they are giving this type of welding so on this the question is there okay they are asking about the welding area and then they are also asking the question on uh, in the gs part that padam shri versus padam bhushan award they are also asking that awards uh, distributed in 2022 who were the people who got awards from uh, award in 2022 uh, from this a lot of questions were there in the gs part then my, as i already told you theory questions of p and i were there but as i said this was for the students of production and industrial branch okay and when we are talking about mechanical you can expect for mechanical one mark questions of gate mechanical theory would be continuing because you know in hcl number of questions are more time is less so level of question was decent it was easy and students were saying that uh, some like there is a topic on current engineering which was asked in gate p and i also so it was also there in hcl reasoning was very easy this was one more input and then vector calculus was having three to four questions uh, they were asking about line integral also divergent also okay then probability was also having two questions in mathematics so mathematics was decent matrix multiplication question was there one question was there from the eigen values and then they were having uh, limits maxima and minima questions and also uh, that theory of failure mdt distortion energy theory it was not a numerical it was from like they were asking about hydrostatic stress which i do it in this in the derivation of mdt then my dear critical radius from heat and mass transfer then fms six sigma from industrial and static inventory model profit loss model or lean manufacturing so guys these were all those areas from which the questions were framed Uh, and as i said this is the input from the pni student because today majorly the paper was for the production industrial student but you may be thinking about mechanical you can get an idea from here like uh, if pni one mark questions were there in this paper obviously mechanical one mark questions can also be there for gs more or less things are going to be similar 
for mathematics things are going to be more or less similar and as the pattern of the paper reasoning and aptitude would be almost easy as per the inputs of the student but as i said this all is memory based because i didn't appear in the exam i asked from the student who appeared so goodbye guys uh, for this particular session stay tuned with us because we are always coming with all the updates related to all the exams so you will get benefited from that goodbye